so much power. You truly would have been the perfect vessel for my Eva. Uh, I'm not a goddamn vessel. Not some stupid copy. I'm me, Rose. And you're done. <gasps> Hey, sweetie. Oh, my God! You're, you're so grown up now. And even though I wasn't there with you, I've always watched over you. I'm so sorry I couldn't protect you. All you've ever done is protect me. No. Not this time. You lost your chance. I'm so sorry. No. It was my choice. And I don't regret it one bit. If I had left you, then we never would have had this chance to talk face to face. back I'm back I think the little boy will be able to touch the moon? Nobody can touch the moon. He's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay. Then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon feels like it. Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, Evelyn. 
Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa. Whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. We have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. She's just a kid. Way to keep it together, Rose. You're a lot like him, you know. I know. Thank you.